family. Check it out. So Isha G and myself, we're trying something today, and I just want to share this with y'all. You know, the Bible says the Most High gave us quail to eat. So me and Isha G, we don't eat chicken, we don't eat chicken eggs, so we eat quail. We had that for the first time the other day. Um, we're about to try quail eggs. Let's show them the quail eggs, babe. So this is one quail egg. Now the cool thing is one of these eggs has more protein. Well, I'm sorry, let me say it right. Enough protein to that you would need four chicken eggs to equal the protein in this one egg. But it takes at least four of these eggs to make one chicken egg. So I'm gonna come back and let y'all know how this tastes. So I'm gonna show y'all this. This is it in the palm of my hands. I have very little hands. This is it. <laughs> so, so it's a very tiny egg. It's only about maybe two inches long. Two inches? If that. Look, I think it's about half an inch. <laughs> so let's see what four of these eggs look like going in the bowl. <laughs> oh man. Y'all. <laughs> <laughs> it's the size of a nickel. <laughs> That's one of these eggs. All right. So look, we'll let y'all know later how this tasted. So y'all stay tuned for that. So this little egg right here. All right. And this is 16 of these because we're trying to make up for the equivalent of two. Is it two, babe? Uh, two each. Two each for me and Isha G. Uh, when we used to eat chicken and chicken eggs, the equivalent of this. So that's what it looks like. We about to cook it up, taste it. I'm going to make me a burrito out of mine. But this quail egg, some potatoes and onions, and a tortilla. And Easy G is going to have her some quail eggs and grits <laughs> with hers. So we're going to let y'all know in a minute how this tastes. All right, family. So this is what 16 quail eggs looks like cooked. Now, myself and Easy G could eat this by ourselves, but we're going to be splitting this between the two of us. Um, but yeah. All right, family, this is it. This is the tasting of quail eggs for the first time. Isha G, she's got her grits, home fries, and quail eggs. I've got me a little burrito here. I've got onions, uh, potatoes, my home fries, quail eggs, and some tomatoes on top. So we're going to go ahead and let's, let's see how Isha G like this. Now give us your honest opinion. I will not tell a lie. <laughs> it tastes like eggs. So no difference? It just tastes like eggs. Let me check this out. Here, take the camera. All right. Let me go ahead and wrap this bad boy up. I know y'all was like, what? That man know how to roll that thing. Oh yeah. Roll the bad boy down. Here we go. Tastes like eggs. Regular. <laughs> I don't honestly, I don't see no difference between the taste. Um, you know, you season it and it's good. Uh, it, my only drawback with them is you need a lot of them to make up for what you get from one chicken egg. But so that's it, family. You know, we just wanted to share with y'all our little experience here in Botswana of trying quail eggs. Man, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. 
Remember to please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And man, y'all just keep praying for us. All right, we got more videos coming later for y'all. Shalom.